The dynamics of power systems operate across various time scales. The time scale associated with the controls of converter interface generation CIG technology spans from microseconds to milliseconds, encompassing wave and electromagnetic effects. With the increasing adoption of CIGs, faster dynamics are becoming crucial for analyzing the behavior of future power systems, surpassing slower phenomena that occur over milliseconds to minutes. Traditionally, focusing on the timescales of electromechanical transients allowed for significant simplifications in power system modeling and analysis. One major simplification was the assumption that voltage and current waveforms were primarily dominated by the system's fundamental frequency 50 or 60 Hz. This led to the development of quasi-static phasor models, which relied on steady-state voltage and current representations. However, this approach primarily addressed slower dynamics while overlooking high-frequency dynamics, such as those stemming from the switching of power electronic devices. Below is the list of five power system stability categories along with a brief explanation for each. Frequency stability focuses on the system's ability to maintain steady frequency levels when there is an imbalance between generation and load. Rapid deviations or prolonged frequency excursions can trigger protective relays and lead to broader outages. Voltage stability involves maintaining acceptable voltage levels throughout the grid. It ensures that the system can accommodate variations in reactive power demand without causing a voltage collapse. Rotor angle stability concerns the maintenance of synchronism between synchronous generators. It reflects the ability of rotating machines to maintain a stable intermachine angle during and after disturbances, which is essential for coherent system operation. Inverter-based stability pertains to the dynamic performance of systems with significant converter interfaced inverter-based renewable energy sources. This category addresses challenges such as fast control responses, reduced inertia, and interactions between inverters and the grid. Resonance stability deals with the prevention of resonant oscillations that can arise from interactions between grid components. These oscillations, if left unchecked, unchecked, can amplify disturbances and potentially lead to equipment damage or system-wide instability. These categories offer a comprehensive framework to evaluate and manage modern power systems, especially in an era marked by diverse energy sources and advanced control technologies. Considering the operational timescales of CIGs, it is essential to extend the scope of analysis to include faster electromagnetic dynamics when these significantly affect overall system behavior. This approach focuses on two primary timescales, electromagnetic and electromechanical. Electromechanical phenomena are further divided into short-term and long-term dynamics, which are commonly analyzed using phasor-based approximations. However, such models are not suitable for representing electromagnetic phenomena, which require different analytical methods. This discussion emphasizes the classification and definition of power system stability phenomena, factoring in the increasing role of CIGs in bulk power systems. The classification is based on the intrinsic dynamics and components involved in stability challenges. Timescales help identify the relevant components, phenomena, and controls that must be modeled to accurately capture specific stability issues. In this context, the discussion, the discussion excludes certain aspects, such as local instabilities due to incorrect control settings, control loop instabilities that can be analyzed without modeling the entire power system, stability issues specific to microgrids, and electromechanical or electromagnetic wave propagation phenomena. Characteristics of Converter Interface Generation CIG Technologies the growing presence of converter interface generation in the energy mix has introduced new challenges in power system stability. These arise due to the distinct dynamic behavior of CIGs compared to traditional synchronous generators. Key factors include the interaction of CIG controls, reduced overall system inertia, and limited ability of CIGs to contribute to short circuit currents during faults. Key characteristics of CIGs and their controllers, the performance of CIGs is largely governed by their control systems and the strategies employed to manage the power electronic converters that link energy sources to the power grid. Most large-scale CIGs are equipped with voltage source converters or similar designs, enabling full four-quadrant control. This allows for independent management of active and reactive currents within the capacity of the electronic switches, providing precise and rapid control of power flow under most conditions. While CIGs pose challenges, they also offer exceptional flexibility in controlling energy sources. 
For example, technologies like photovoltaic PV systems and battery energy storage systems best enable rapid and sustained frequency responses. The key considerations when assessing the influence of CIGs on system dynamics include Short circuit current contribution, CIGs generally offer limited short circuit current support, with contribu contributions ranging from none in cases where converters block during severe faults to a maximum of about 1.5 times their rated current. Some systems, like type 3 wind turbines with double-fed induction generators, can provide more short circuit current since their stators are directly connected to the grid. Roll of control loops, the phase locked loop PLL and inner current control loops significantly affect dynamic recovery post fault. For connection points with low short circuit strength, these controls may exhibit oscillatory behavior due to synchronization issues or excessive controller gains. Adjusting these gains can help mitigate the issue, although the specific thresholds depend on the equipment and system setup. Dynamic performance determinants, the overall behavior of CIGs is shaped by the dynamic characteristics of the PLL, inner current control loops, and higher level control strategies. These dynamics span a broad range, from high frequency electromagnetic phenomena kilohertz range to slower voltage and frequency stability issues hertz range. Definition of power system stability, the definition of power system stability aims to provide a clear, practical framework for understanding and applying stability concepts in power systems. It offers a physically grounded perspective that aligns with system theory while remaining accessible to engineering practitioners. Despite the transformation in power systems driven by the integration of converter interface generation CIG and power electronics-based control devices, this definition continues to hold relevance and remains unchanged. Formal definition, power system stability refers to the ability of an electric power system, under given initial conditions, to return to a balanced operating state after experiencing a disturbance. It requires that most system variables remain within acceptable bounds to ensure the system's overall integrity and functionality. The concept applies universally to the dynamic behavior of interconnected power systems, encompassing both synchronous machines and conventional components. Particularly, it is effective in describing stability performance in systems with CIGs. Similar to how a remote synchronous machine losing synchronism does not necessarily destabilize the entire system, the dynamic response of an isolated CIG also has limited impact on system-wide stability as long as it does not trigger cascading failures. To understand this stability in detail, mathematical models of power systems based on differential algebraic equation, equations are employed, along with definitions from system theory. With the growing use of power electronic inverters and the necessity to model protection systems, the principles of stability also extend to hybrid systems that combine continuous dynamics with discrete events. Stability in hybrid systems involve interactions between continuous processes and discrete events. Their stability depends on maintaining proximity to equilibrium points or converging back to equilibrium after disturbances. Lyapunov stability principles apply to these systems but require additional conditions ensuring non-increasing behavior during discrete events. Challenges in hybrid systems include phenomena like deadlock or infinite switching loops conditions that arise due to model artifacts rather than real-world occurrences. Accurate modeling is critical to avoid these complications, especially in scenarios involving interactions between continuous and discrete elements. Real-world examples have highlighted the role of hybrid dynamics in power system events, such as voltage oscillations caused by transformer tapping and capacitor switching. These dynamics underline the importance of careful system design to manage the interplay between continuous controls and discrete actions effectively. Classification of power system stability and importance of classification. The classification of power system stability has evolved to include new categories, reflecting the growing adoption of converter interface generation CIG technologies. Two additional stability classes, referred to as converter-driven stability and resonance stability, have been introduced to address challenges specific to CIGs. These additions were necessary due to the unique dynamic behaviors associated with modern power electronic, electronic systems. In earlier classifications, the category of subsynchronous resonance was excluded because it fell outside the time scale of interest. However, with the inclusion of power electronic dynamics, the scope of stability analysis has expanded to encompass electromagnetic transients, broadening the time scale under consideration.